Hey everyone, it's another month and that means another Walmart haul and I wanted to do like a top 10 but I couldn't limit myself to 10 things. So I have nine fashion pieces, four beauty things to talk about and one just completely random thing that if you follow me on Instagram stories you already know about and I'm here to report back on how it is working. So let's start with fashion. Everything I'm about to share with you comes in extra small through triple XL so the sizing is the same for all of them. And don't forget, be sure to check down in the description box because I list everything that I'm talking about, listed it in the order in which it appears here in the video. I've got links, sizing, prices, all the things. But if it's not everything you need, be sure to let me know in the comments and I'll do my best to answer any questions. All right, let's start with this hoodie set. Now, you know I'm not a big fan of shorts, but when I saw this on the website, I hit add to cart so quickly. This two-piece Terry set is sold as two separates, so you can buy the hoodie separate from the shorts. I would say they run true to size, but with all shorts, I like to size up one. So I'm wearing the hoodie in a small and the shorts in a medium. They also come in one other color in a deep navy. These are so fun for summer. I could see wearing this in lieu of a more traditional swimsuit cover up or just wearing it as loungewear around the house or absolutely cute enough to leave the house in. You could wear it in all one shade like I'm doing or you can mix and match and do a little color blocking. I think if this is one of the cutest things I've seen come out of Walmart in a really long time. And I just want you to note that I'm wearing these with some vintage Walmart sandals. I bought these a few years ago. They're one of my favorite shoe purchases. I still have the link, but I highly doubt it's stocked very well, if at all. But I just wanted to share with you that I do hold on to my Walmart stuff. I love what I get, I keep it, and I wear it year after year. Sticking with extremely casual summer wear, there is nothing more, I wanna say basic or classic, than a tank top and a pair of cutoff shorts. And this is no exception. Now you've seen the shorts before. I believe these came from last month's haul. I'm still loving these shorts. They're one of my best sellers for the month of May. They're really, really comfortable, very lightweight. So they, they are denim, but they feel almost like a t-shirt. They're that lightweight. But let's talk about the actual new product I wanna share with you, which is this V-neck tank top. It comes in 11 colors. It's under $7 super soft feather weight tees, sort of that garment dyed look to it. So you get these nice bright colors, but it's not, well, it doesn't look quite like this. And this is coming at the very end. I like them so much. I bought them in three colors, the orange that you see, as well as an olive green and then a basic black. There's some tie dye options as well. What I really like about these tanks is they're slightly longer. They're a little more like a tissue weight material. And I like that it's a V-neck, but it's not too low and that the armholes are up a little bit higher. So you can very confidently wear a normal bra with these tank tops. I have three dresses to share with you. And the first one is a true standout because the details on this dress are exquisite. And it's something you would expect from a higher level retailer, not necessarily something that is in a more budget category like Walmart. And that is why Walmart is killing it because they are putting that attention to detail on a lot of their pieces and they're keeping these prices affordable, which I love. So this is a faux wrap, 100% cotton poplin dress. I love cotton poplin, and it's a fabric I rarely see outside of a much higher price point. So already I am hooked. I love a wrap style, but I personally don't love a true wrap dress or skirt. I find them very difficult to wear. So I love that this is faux wrap. And here's the detail that I love. It has a nice little hidden snap in the front, for the bodice so you can open it to get it on more easily and then snap it shut for a little more coverage. The back has a nice long zip and then a hook and eye closure at the top. It has a removable belt. I like this belt with it, but you could always take it off and add one of your own choosing. It has a nice little side slit to make it easier to walk around. I will say the only thing it doesn't have, and I bet you know exactly what I'm gonna say, I wish it had pockets, but you can't have everything. This is definitely roomy, 
I'm on the fence between an extra small and a small. I think I can wear the small just fine, but I'd prefer because of the nature of the fabric to have it a little more uh, slim fitting. So I might try this in an extra small. It comes in four color options, two solids, this pink that you're seeing, it's like a pink lilac, and then a true white, and then two gingham, really tiny check gingham patterns, navy and white, and mint green and white as well. If you are a bride or you know a bride this summer, I think the white version would make a really sweet dress for a shower. The second dress that I have to share with you is another standout. This is a linen rayon blend. It's 51% linen. So it's a nice linen that doesn't get too wrinkly because of that rayon addition to it. It does have pockets, which I really like. It only comes in the one color, this black with the white contrast stitching. I love those little extra details. This one does have pockets. And another detail that I really appreciate, yes, it has thinner straps, but the way they're cut and, the, and where they're placed, you can wear a regular bra with this if that's the way that you want to go. I love all the little details about this. It's just either you step in or pull it over your head. I just stepped into it and pulled it up. A Little bit of elastic in the waist. It is a little more fitted in the bodice, but that give it the waist makes it easier to get it on and off as well. Beautiful summer dress. And then the last summer dress that I have to share with you this month anyway, is the one that I have on. It is quite a departure from what I normally pick in that I, if you haven't noticed, I'm a little picky about sticking with pieces where I don't have to wear a special bra. And this one, unfortunately, you can't just stick with your standard two strap bra. You're either gonna need one of those funky ones with the one strap that comes off, or today I'm just wearing a strapless bra. But I kind of, I mean, I don't kind of, I like it. So this color block dress comes in three color blocking options. I am a sucker for pink and green together. I love it. Um, it may be because I came of age in the late 80s, early 90s, and pink and green was just kind of the ultimate color combo back then. This one is 100% rayon, so it's really light, it's really flowy. Mine came, I will say, very wrinkled, but because it's 100% rayon, it was really easy to steam most of the wrinkles out. I'll say I didn't spend as much time as I could have. I was kind of in a hurry to get this one on, but the wrinkles came out very easily. It does tie. On the sides, it has like a little like string tie that definitely you need to have some sort of definition there, but it's not the kind that wraps all the way around. It starts on each side and it just ties in the front. This does have pockets, which is a nice bonus. And this sleeve, it is technically a long sleeve, but it's not a full length sleeve, fully extended. It comes to about bracelet length, but it has this elastic hem so you could blouse it up and kind of put it wherever you want. You can make it almost like a kind of longer short sleeve. It just depends. This is a tighter elastic, so it's gonna stick wherever you put it, but it's not cutting off my circulation either, which is nice. I do have one pre-order again for this month. I think this is a fun concept that Walmart is doing, giving you the chance to pre-order. Um, I do wanna give you a follow-up on the dress that I ordered last month on pre-order. It is slated for delivery June 22nd, so I still don't have it. There are a handful, I mean a very small amount of that dress available in large and extra large and double XL, depending on which of the two colors you are looking for. So if you are in that size range, I would recommend that, and you want it, I would recommend hopping on real fast before it's all sold out. But this month's pre-order, when I saw this, I got really excited because this is very similar to an eyelet blouse that I saw at J. Crew a year or two ago that I meant to buy and I didn't and I missed out on it. And this seems to be almost the exact same one. It's a long sleeved eyelet blouse, has some cute little tie detail from what I can see, comes in a bright green, white, or hot pink, like a bright, like more, this is more bubblegum pink, but an even more brighter, like azalea pink. It looks super cute. It is currently only available for pre-order, so of course I hit add to cart as well, and I will update you with that one on stories when the two pieces do come in. I do want to touch on the two pairs of shoes, technically three pairs that I got in the last month. First are these braided sandals. I love these. These have been on the site for a while, but they keep selling out, and then luckily they seem to have been fully restocked, so I snatched up two of the colors. There are, well, I'm gonna put it on the screen. There are quite a few color options. So I picked them up in ivory, and I also 
just got them in this blush color. These are so comfortable, very similar to the other braided sandals that I have. The heel is a little bit lower. The sole is a little bit more smushy. It has the memory foam and the straps are a little less stiff. So I gotta tell you, these are so comfortable. I could walk for miles in them and I have. They're fantastic. The second pair of shoes that I picked up this month are an espadrille, slightly different silhouette than what I usually share. This is more of a platform type sandal. I love the chain detail. This also comes in black. These run very wide. I did not order the wide width, but there's a lot of room here. I got it in a seven. I can do a six and a half or a seven generally. I probably could get away with a with a six and a half. So if you're in between, I would size down half just because of that extra wide room here. Um, I'm not too short on the length here, so I could probably scooch down, but I'm keeping these. They are really fun to wear. They have this chain detail, like I mentioned before, which makes it a little different than your typical summer espadrille. And I love the neutral cream color. I do have some beauty products to share with you, not a ton. First of all, I'm a little more tan than I usually am. And today's tan is brought to you by B-Tan. <laughs> I, I just felt like I had to say it that way. Uh, B-Tan is new to me. I've used this a few times. They have a bunch of different options. I bought the one product in their line called literally I want the darkest tan possible. There's another one that I saw that had great reviews and I think that one was called Tan AF. Uh, this one says it's a one hour self tan mousse. My advice with the self tanners regardless of whether it's a full length like six to eight hour developed tan or a express tan, don't believe them put it on at night, sleep in it, rinse it off in the morning. I will say this, it's not the darkest tan I've ever gotten. It's a pretty decent tan, but it is the longest lasting at home self tanner I've ever used. So it's pretty amazing and it doesn't smell offensive. To go with my slightly darker color, I had to change up my foundation and I just picked up one of my all time favorites. This is the L'Oreal True Match Nude Hyaluronic Tinted Serum. When I'm not tan, I wear shade 0.5, the very light shade. It's literally called very light. And I have bumped all the way up to shade 2.3 light. Uh, but it, it's a perfect match for me right now. I usually don't put self tanner on my face, but I will just put on foundation to match the rest of me and this is working out great. Two more products that I picked up in my recent Walmart haul, it was during a grocery shopping haul technically, but um, to prep for the tan, this is an oldie but a goodie. I've used this off and on for years and it's back. It's the Soap and Glory Flake Away Body Scrub. It's just a really nice physical scrub to use in the shower. You can use this to prep for a tan. You can use this in between. One of my favorite uses for this particular scrub is for when I come in from the pool. This is what I use to get the sunscreen off my body. There's just something about, so I know you can just use soap. You should use soap first. SPF just sticks, which it's meant to do, especially if you're using water resistant SPF, but you gotta get it off. And the body scrub really helps, so I love this, and it smells delicious too. And then this is reminiscent of my childhood. My mom used to get this, and I thought this was the coolest, most decadent, luxurious shower gel. And fast forward like 40 years, and it's still around, and it's still as good, if not better than I remember, the Neutrogena Rain Bath, refreshing shower and bath gel, so you can run a bubble bath with this. It smells expensive, it feels expensive, it leaves you feeling clean without feeling stripped of moisture. It's fantastic. This is a classic. I am so glad that I have it back in my life, and it is under $10 for this big bottle. Yay. Then I have one sort of follow-up. I just, I don't know why we bought this, but we saw this. I think it was in the made for TV aisle. And this is an Arctic air neck fan and you wear it like so. It has little vents at the top. There is a button here. There are three speeds, I think. And it's just blowing air up my neck. I feel very, let me turn this off. I feel ridiculous. Okay. This is such a fun thing to have if you 
are gonna be spending any kind of time outside, whether you're watching your kids play sports, you're going for a walk with the dog, maybe, I've tried to get Michael to take this with him when he plays golf. He said he can't wear it when he swings, but he can wear it in between strokes, maybe in the cart. This is a nice, solid piece of machinery here. It definitely works. What I like is I wear contacts, and if I have a fan blowing right into my eyes, it dries up my contacts. This blows up the sides, but my eyes aren't getting dried out. I know, and it's hands-free. You're gonna, it looks, it's, it's a look, but I like it. It looks very modern and sleek, and I definitely am recommending it. Glad that we purchased it. So that is this month's Walmart haul, again, with some fantastic finds, fantastic prices. Thank you to all of you who, by the way, mentioned that you found that scoop eyelet dress that I love so much in red. It keeps selling out. I will find it. I appreciate all of you sending me the DMs or letting me know when you found it in one of your stores. Let me know if any of these pieces stood out to you or if you found anything amazing at Walmart, let us know down in the comments below. I love it when we all talk amongst ourselves. Thank you so much for hanging out with me today and I'll see you in the next video. Bye.